Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well and I just wanted to share something with you guys. There's a few things that I wanted to talk about, the things that went wrong, the things that we planned, the things that we did that didn't quite work out. People who are on this platform, we usually only show the things that did work, the things that went well, the things that, you know, make us look better. But can I tell you, I am just a human being. There's a lot of things that I tried to do this year which just simply didn't work out. And I wanted to share some of my failures with you. One of the things that I wanted to do in 2022 was to read more books. Objectively, I did. I did read more books. I read about probably 72 books. A lot of them were really short books. Like I'm talking about one of my favorite books, the Hardy Boy series. Even though 72 books sounds like a lot, I mean, there's 365 days in a year. I only read less than one third of that. I didn't do so good at reading. Number two. Another goal that I had this year was I wanted to work on my drone business, trying to improve on my videography skills, trying to make myself more marketable. This year I traveled more with my parents and as I was traveling, I was also studying at the same time to become a licensed drone pilot, specifically getting my P107, which if you have your P107, you can start commercializing your drone business. From the time that I got the idea to the time I passed my exam, it was about, I would say two months. And yes, I got my drone license and I feel really accomplished, but to be honest, it's just really hard to find clients. I did get a client, but it was my own fault that I didn't reach out, I didn't follow up. Number three, Another thing that I failed at this year was having a better diet. I failed at taking better care of myself. Diet has been an important thing that I've neglected. Taking care of my body so that I can work better, I can function better. My worst habit is that I don't feed myself the right food. I eat a lot of junk food. And guys, I'm telling you, if you want to be successful, it's all in the little things. There's a great book that I was talking to my friend today about. He was actually mentioning it to me and it's called Atomic Habits. The things that you do, the ordinary mundane little things that you do, it adds up. Sleeping at the right time. I feel like I failed at managing my time on the digital platform, managing my time, my energy, and just putting the right nutrient inside my body. Other thing that I failed at this year, my finances. I would say I come from a very fortunate situation. My parents, they work really hard and I, I live pretty comfortably. I went to school, I don't have any student loans. And uh, for me, at a young age, I've always been financially smart and tried to keep my expenses low. But I do realize that I could be better at managing my finances. I could be better at managing my budget and my money. One really important thing that I really wanted to talk about with this upcoming year coming up is that, well, in one of the art and one piece, it's where they're going to the new world. One of the things that I really was resonating this year was where Luffy and his friends, they realized that they're not ready. They're not ready for this next challenge. They're not ready for this new season. And so um, they took two years, two years to prepare themselves mentally, physically, and just to train. And to be honest, for me, I feel like as fortunate as I've been, the amazing things that I've accomplished, I've failed at a lot of things that I could work on. And, and so I've decided that I'm going to be taking a break, taking two years just to work on myself physically, mentally, come back with better ideas, better content. To be honest, when I started YouTube, I wanted to make content that would help people out. I haven't been really doing that. I feel like I've just been making content for the sake of making content. Guys, I think that's pretty much it. That's, um, I hope that you guys kind of reassess, reevaluate where you are in life. Um, super important, super awesome, super great exercise to do just to, you know, figure out what you want to do. The best investment you can make is in yourself. And I just wanted to say thank you for listening to me ramble on, on the things that I failed, the things that I want to improve on. Peace out.